What's up everybody, it's Critical. Like many others, I was tuning into the whole Total Eclipse thing, the American Freedom Eclipse, and while I was waiting for it to come to Tampa, I decided to watch some streams on it because I was very excited. Tampa often doesn't get a lot of the big conventions and big shows, so I was very pleased that my city's petitions to the sun gods didn't fall on deaf ears and they were going to bring the show to Tampa as well, albeit a little bit later. But I wanted to scratch this itch, I wanted a little sneak peek behind the scenes action, so I tuned into the NASA Twitch broadcast of it, and man, that was an absolute fucking jumbled mess. Let's go ahead and play some of this. So let's go right now to Salem, Oregon, to hopefully catch a glimpse. There's a large celebration underway, coordinated by the board. The first thing you'll notice is the sinking of the voices is very off. This is one of the first signs and symptoms of a total solar eclipse disrupting the magnetic quantum beams from our technology, throwing off all of our voice syncing technology. NASA was hit very hard by this. Now I know most people were all hyped up and expecting some cosmic werewolves and interstellar vampires, as well as some cybernetic goblins starting to roam the Earth for a brief period of time during the eclipse, but really the only things we got from the eclipse were this bad NASA broadcast, as well as the total eclipse making my penis a little bit smaller. Museum of Science and Industry. So Jesse Carpenter from NASA's Ames Research Center is standing by. The fact that the corona is so hot, that's like if you were standing next to a fireplace and as you moved away, it got hotter, which is crazy. But we know that it's from those dynamic magnetic fields that we're seeing here. This look on their face is one of pure horror. It's as if someone on the camera team just bent over and showed them the whole dirty chocolate starfish asshole they have, and they're just disgusted and taken aback. They're getting some bad news here. Okay, I, I just got word that we haven't started. Okay. This sounds like the fucking horrendous voice acting from the original House of the Dead arcade games. Okay, I guess we're going from the top. <laughs> The dude's face says it all. I think that look right there basically just kind of sums up the entire solar eclipse in a nutshell. That's it. See ya.